stature is derived from the general work of this scientist. With and the theory now says a cell is the structural is the structural and the functional functional unit of living organism. And it is capable of replicating itself. What does this one mean? It said this portrait unit of life means every the physical body. The, the, the physique of everyone is made up of cells. When you talk about the morphology of a body, you are talking about how the body looks like, how the body is. They are all made up of cells. They are functional. In other words, as I'm talking to you, is because the cells of my tongues, the jaw, the, the cheek, the my larynx, the, the all are functioning. That's why I'm able to talk. Even the brain, the cells of the brain are working. That's how. That is why I'm able to communicate with you now. Your movement of your hands, your eyelids, and everything are function of the cells. If cells fail to work, nobody the the part of that body is is gone. So this this theory holds true in every situation that a cell is the structural and functional unit of living organisms. Now, that is the cell theory. Let's now look at the cell structure. But you should also know that we, people still define cell as the basic unit of life. Basic unit of life that is capable of reproducing itself. 